the new bumper cover. But as you can see, there is nothing wrong with the front. All right, Hustle Nation, I just wanted to let you guys know we have also added the giveaway for my 2012 Lexus RX 350. Make sure you get your tickets while you can, while they are double entries. Now, these are two separate giveaways. Do not get these confused. Now, I do have a bonus package at the bottom for you, and this will never change. So you get 2,000 entries. You're going to get 1,000 for Goldilocks, 1,000 for Lexi. But for right now, all entries are doubled. So click the link in the description below to have your entries doubled until Sunday midnight sale ends. And don't forget that the number in the parentheses is how many times your name will be entered in the pot. Hustle Daily, what's going on, Hustle Nation? Welcome back to another video. It's your boy, Big Play, coming to y'all with another video, man. We on the road today. Today, we're going to go ahead and get our box, our um, our toolbox, uh, what you call that, vacuumed, because it's a little dusty in there, so we're going to get it all cleaned up. Um, I was about to put this TV radio in there, as you can see, my double den. Um, I forgot what the, what what I got that out of it's been a long time but I was about to put that in the car but I see that you need like a kit for uh, it to work so like this is not gonna work because you can see this here now you could probably like cut it somebody with a Dremel probably could like just cut it or I could buy a Dremel rather and I could just cut it and it may fit instead of buying a whole new freaking piece right but it's a kit on Amazon it comes with everything man it comes with the whole piece trim piece the wiring harness the antenna even though i got an antenna on there i don't need an antenna um, continue on arnold road for two miles rolling boy so um yeah but i'm also thinking about putting my bumper cover on on the uh rx today i'm thinking about doing it today just go ahead and getting it over with uh I was supposed to take the truck to get fixed for the tire rods month for tire rods Monday, but I realized that the parts is not going to be here till Tuesday, so that's not good, man. So that means we can't get it done Monday, and then the dude said Tuesday around 2:30, so that's we're probably not going to be uh, we probably gonna have to get it done like Wednesday because I don't think I think Tuesday I'll probably be too late for him to go ahead and do it, so. Most likely, we'll probably be getting the truck fixed Wednesday. And um, I, I know how to do tire rods and stuff, y'all. I just, I'm just, I don't want to do it. You know what I mean? You got to have that stuff precise. You probably, I'm going to probably need an alignment anyway, unless you can get it, like, really good. Some people are, ugh, some people are better than it than others. But, you know what I mean? I'd rather just have somebody else doing it, charging me a decent price. So, I have him do it. But, um... Yep, so that's what we're doing, man. We're going to go ahead and stop and probably vacuum this thing first. And then we'll go ahead and go over there by the Lexus truck. If I feel like it, which I think I do, just go ahead and put that bumper cover on and that um, that fender liner. You know what I mean? But I'll catch you guys when I get over there. You know what I'm saying? We ride in the truck. Y'all got any names for the truck? Let me know in the comments below. I haven't thought of nothing yet. But uh, as you can see, if I'm trying to put the TV radio and stuff in the truck, then, you know, I kind of plan on probably having it for a while you know what i mean i'm gonna see look online to see if somebody actually just cut that part without buying a whole nother piece but like i say it's 79 dollars to buy the whole thing but um yeah we'll see so um yeah i'll catch you guys in a few when i get over there to the vacuum to vacuum this thing out okay so no, all right y'all yeah, so here we go while they get the truck oh wow i didn't even know i had was set i was had that set up right there like that but that's what we about to use anyway but so i need new locks apparently he said i need new locks he said you just pop the lock out like with this just pull it and apparently it comes out i gotta see i gotta take it out to see exactly what type of lock it is um or maybe I can like Google that and have the key maybe, I don't know. Not Google it, but yeah, you can see all of this in here. So we about to get this all cleaned out, man. Get it all 
looking all good. Got some nails and stuff in there. We're gonna vacuum all of those nails. So let me go ahead and get the uh, other one open. Definitely need, I'm not gonna keep nothing in here yet until I actually, you know, get the lock on there. You feel me? But yep, yeah, y'all see it, man. I like it. It's like wasp and, well, really wasp. That's a B. Really wasp, they really love this freaking truck, man. So let me uh pull it up, get y'all set up, and we about to vacuum it. I can, I can vacuum a little bit up on the inside, but uh not that much. We pretty much clean. Damn, I pulled up and it fell. <laughs> All right, let's get to it, y'all. Check that out, y'all. Fits perfectly, man. Now, this is not all my stuff, but the stuff that I did bring, man, it fits perf perfectly in this box. Now, this one, I think, is going to need another shock. Um, so, I'll probably have to measure this and give me another toolbox shock there around that size. I'll probably have to take it off and just see what size that is. And again, we got to find some locks, man. Definitely got to find some locks. That may be this, what we need right there. What does that say? Uh, y'all can't see it but it says ba2106 so uh maybe we can find some stuff like that but all right let's go ahead and do this bumper um i think i'm gonna do it today so it's feeling nice outside and you know not that bad out here it's actually kind of nice it's sun out so i actually may head over there to the rx truck and go ahead and do that so let's go ahead and do that all right guys so here is the truck um over here by the truck um like i say the parts won't be here yet i do have the bumper cover here so we are about to get this thing installed man might as well right it's a nice day out um shouldn't be too hard um, I got more fog lights. I'm gonna keep that fog light in. I'm gonna just add the other one. Um, yeah, so let me set you guys up and let's go ahead and get this done. And maybe you guys can see it from here. So you see how the wheel is kind of straight there. When you look over here, you can definitely see how it's tilted in. If you can't see, I can definitely see it. But let's go ahead and change this bumper cover. And um, yeah, let's go ahead and do it. got our bumper cover off so now we're about to go ahead and install the new bumper cover but as you can see there is nothing wrong with the front um it was literally just a cover i, I got the fender liner too um and this is a good time for me to look in here and make sure everything is good everything is good everything looks good even i can even see in here more now um Still can't tell just by looking at this that the all oh, the tie rod back there that the tie rod is bad, but let's go ahead and get everything together. Uh do I got some electrical tape for this? I think this is gonna go for our fog light, right? One, two. So yeah, one should I actually may need another clip. So this one got three, this one got two. This one has two, which should be, hmm, oh, 
this comes off okay yeah so this one comes off and this one we're missing this one which is we gotta just tighten them wires up i'm gonna go ahead and do that i'm missing this one here oh this one goes into the um the sensors Oh, okay, we're missing a sensor here. Okay, I see what's going on. All right, let me go ahead and fix this though. Um, yeah, let me go ahead and fix this, I'll be back. All right, y'all, so we're gonna take some of these pieces, put them on here. That's perfect. some more little pieces hold on It's hard to get out. Ah. All right, It'll be a minute getting that out, but we'll definitely get it out. Let me show you what I'm talking about. This right here. Just trying to get this little plastic piece, these plastic pieces out. not even a grill yet. Hold up. Got another one here. There we go. Alright, now we're going to try to install it on this right here.
put the rope on me. There's another one. There's another one. I think there's another one, but I don't know where the heck it is. Where the other one is, but wait, there should be enough. Well, no, it is one more. I don't know where that last one is, but we'll figure it out. And all right, guys, I got everything all hooked up. As you can see, I got the fog light on. That's the old fog light. Um, maybe I should put the new what you call it on there. Um, yeah, because I don't even know if that lights up. So I'm actually gonna change this put the new one in there just as above i'm gonna just take it out the other one for sure so got the lower grill in there a little bottom piece that was attached and i also found the other clip so yep let's go ahead and get this thing going y'all guys so you guys see what's going on new bumper cover on baby everything fit nicely everything fit good so we are good to go there's a little gap here but that's not a big deal like i say some, when you buy aftermarket covers a lot of them be having like they don't be perfect you know even the gs that i gave away still wasn't perfect um we do got the fender liner on i'm about to see if i can get the fender liner i think i got the right sockets we will see uh, maybe that one we'll see so let's see if i can put the fender liner on and then um yeah then we just gotta wait for our uh tire rods to come in nation if you're interested in learning how to buy sell properly inspect these cars at auctions or private party sales make sure you head over to whdacademy.com you're going to learn how to spot a bad car in seconds how to get your dealer license how not to get scammed from the auctions or private parties and how not to get a limit i got a lot of tips a lot of tricks and a lot of techniques in this academy that's going to teach you everything you need to know to be successful in this auction game i didn't help thousands of other people you can see what they're saying i have helped all these people here you see in the comment section and who has been replying about the my academy so make sure you check out the website guys i got two options on there for you guys you get the full curriculum or i can just give you the basic how to inspect car package see you guys on the inside if you're interested all right y'all getting ready to wrap it up over here um so this is the fender liner on this side I'm noticing that I probably need that piece over here so it can fit like properly right here. That's what I'm thinking. I mean, I know this goes there and so yeah, that'll go there. So I gotta put a clip there and stuff like that. So yeah, but we did get off, but I am missing this piece that goes there the little vent piece so i gotta order the little vent piece uh, we'll get that in um it would have been better if i probably put that on first but it's all good i didn't know i was missing it so we will just uh put all this together here with some clips but <clears throat> y'all see what we got looking good man new fender liner and everything 
So let me finish putting my clips in and then, man, we are done. I could throw this one away. All right, guys. So um, all you had to do was slide that thing out like my boy Bruce said. So um, I definitely should be able to get um, one of these ASAP. I'm going to take the picture of that number maybe to find me some locks. I think that's how it goes. Oh, I see it, and it just pushes that. Okay, got it. And this was the thing right here that you just kind of slide right there. Did y'all see that? So, so let's see. Make sure it opens. Hold on. Yeah. Okay, perfect. All right, now. The bumper is installed, guys. So I gotta put my uh, tires back the right way. But bumper's good. Bumper's looks good. Doesn't look bad because it's already black. You know what I'm saying? Just need Rich to add that metallic to this joint. Um, we gotta see if we can find that little bottom piece. And that's it, man. Let me fix my tire real quick. Hold on. All right. And y'all see it, man. About to hop back in the pack up in the truck appreciate y'all for tuning in and rocking with me man shout out to the whole hustle nation appreciate y'all love y'all about to drive the truck back home can't wait to the paint um so now that we got our front bumper cover on we need to do the tire rods our alignment and we also need to don't forget the door so we still got to get the door fixed so we're going to take that to rich and see what they can fix that door or what we have to get oh sorry another door so Appreciate y'all. Shout out to the whole Hustle Nation. Like, comment, subscribe. Love you guys. It's your boy Ray, Big Play Ray. I'm out. All right, Hustle Nation. I just wanted to let you guys know we have also added the giveaway for my 2012 Lexus RX 350. Make sure you get your tickets while you can, while they are double entries. Now, these are two separate giveaways. Do not get these confused. Now, I do have a bonus package at the bottom for you and this will never change so you get 2,000 entries you're going to get 1,000 for Goldilocks 1,000 for Lexi but for right now all entries are doubled so click the link in the description below to have your entries doubled until Sunday midnight sale ends and don't forget that the number in the parentheses is how many times your name will be entered in the pot